Hey everyone, this is Dietrich and I'm here to talk to you about our animated videos tool. Alright, so I'm here in my back office and to get to it, I'm just going to select on this box here. Um, but before I go in, I want to go over our tutorial videos really quickly. Um, just to show you that we, although there is um, a lot of things for you to work with on the tool, uh, we make it very, very easy for you to go and learn um, step by step how to work with each individual one. Um, so let's come in here to our editor. Um, I just added in a new um, project here, gave it a name here, um, and now we're here with our blank canvas to work. Um, now I've already added in the background here. Um, if you want to do your own, just select on the background icon over here on the right, and just roll your mouse over um, the blank canvas. It's going to show you the different images. This allows for these high quality images to load a lot faster on your screen. Um, so let's say we want to select a new one um, like this one, and then now we can add on different text. Um, different characters and animations. So if we come over here to our text icon and get rid of our default, we can put in our own text. Like this is a video sales letter. Okay, we can choose our different transitions by coming down here to the bottom, uh, rolling over each one to see what they look like before we actually choose the one that we want. Um, I'm going to go with the handwriting here. And this um, particular effect is going to allow me to choose my own hand. Um, by selecting one of the defaults or adding my own by making a PNG image of it. All right, so let's go ahead and select this first one, click on choose, and then insert our text here. All right, now what we're going to do is come down here to our timeline and move our cursor down. If you want to create different checkpoints, you cancel by double click on a timeline, getting rid of it by going like so. All right, now if you go through our tutorials, we do show you how to work more with the timeline, how to get um, the best results out of your images. And what we're going to do is also come over here to our library and show you that we have animated characters for you to work with, static characters as well. You can also create your own avatars by selecting on your faces here. Okay, if you want to lengthen or shorten your timeline, just go like such and click on the plus and minus on the bottom, and you're good to go. All right, so to learn more, just go ahead and open up the animated videos tool, play around a little bit, and then go and watch some of our tutorial videos to get started. Thank you, and I'll talk to you next time.